Welcome to HDTV. You're now rocking with your boy. Hashtag your body, your choice. Texas Senator Ted Cruz backs NBA players hesitant about vaccine. Senator Ted Cruz, Republican of Texas, is rallying behind NBA players who have expressed hesitancy about receiving a COVID-19 vaccine. In a tweet, he singled out four players, Kyrie Irving, Andrew Wiggins, Bradley Bill, and Jonathan Isaacs. I stand with Kyrie Irving. I stand with Andrew Wiggins. I stand with Bradley Bill. I stand with Jonathan Isaac, Cruz tweeted. Cruz also commended LeBron James, the Los Angeles Lakers star, who said on Tuesday that he was vaccinated but would not use his platform to encourage others to receive the vaccine. NBA players are not required to be vaccinated for the upcoming season, but they will be subject to more stringent protocols, such as daily testing, unvaccinated players on teams whose cities require the vaccine in NBA stadiums would also be prohibited from playing in home games. Urban plays for the Brooklyn Nets in a city where vaccines are required in indoor public places. Rolling Stone reported that he recently began like liking Instagram posts from a vaccine conspiracy theorist. Bill, a Washington wizard, said Monday that I would ask questions to those who are getting vaccinated. Why are you still getting COVID? Cruz is fully vaccinated and he said Thursday that he supports vaccination, but he opposes attempts to mandate the vaccine. It shouldn't be some politician forcing you to get vaccinated. Whether it's the mayor of a city or an NBA team, Cruz told the Star Telegram, each of us should make our own health care decisions. <clears throat> Excuse me. Cruz's tweet also include hashtag your body, your choice. A phrase similar to one used by abortion advocates, Texas has been under scrutiny for enacting an effective ban on all abortions after six weeks of pregnancy, even in cases of rape and incest. The use of the hashtag prompted widespread condemnation on Twitter. Cruz, an abortion opponent, defended the use of the hashtag on Thursday. The reason why Texas law today restricts abortion is to protect the body and the life of the unborn child, Cruz said. I very much believe in your body, your choice. If you want to do whatever you want to your body, knock yourself out. But you don't have the right to harm somebody else's body. So, Ted Cruz speaks up and says, you know what? I'm with the players. And I've been saying the same thing. Why is it that they're forcing the vaccine? Now, I'm fully vaccinated. Due to my family, my mom is older, and due to my job, they don't play about that. But I think our job um, basically says that you could get it or not, or you, you could take it if you want or not. They haven't, I think, been strict on it. But I did it because I'm around a group of people, and I meet different people every day, so that's why I did it. Now, people are like, man, you're still getting it. Well, you still get the flu virus. Even if you get the flu shot, you still get the flu virus. And and the reason um you get the flu virus is because, see, they give you the virus. They basically give you the virus. So what they're feeling is that it will be able to combat the other virus. Well, it will combat the same virus that's affecting you. And what it would do is it will wipe them out and keep you healthy. But, yeah, you will still catch it. Even if you got the vaccine, you still will catch it. Um, and I don't have a problem with those players opposing and basically saying, I want more information. Bradley Bill said, I would take it, but I just want information. I just want to ask a question. Nicki Minaj got her whole Twitter pulled because she was asking a question. She never said, I don't want to take this vaccine. I don't want to do this. She never said that. And I had to explain that to my mother and explain that to some some other people at my job. It's like, bro, they're not she's not saying she's against it. She's just questioning. That's it. We as Americans have a right to ask questions. But for some reason, they do not want us to ask questions, do they? They don't want us to have they, they, they just want us to have um. They, they just want us basically to be mindless robots. 
And that's what they want us to do. They want us to be robots. They don't want us to ask questions. They don't want us to feel like, oh, well, you know. Oh, well, you know. It's to save you. Joe Biden, you guys wanted him. And all he's done is cause nothing but BS. <laughs> Which he has. Which he has. And where's Kamala and Harris? Kamala, where you at, Kamala? You've been awfully quiet during all of this stuff. I guess you done got in the White House, so now you finna go ball with your girls. So it, it's just... <laughs> It's just mind boggling to me how Cruz has to come out and say this. And, you know, Ted Cruz saying it because he's basically sending shots. So, like I said, I don't know. But I just feel like, in my opinion, is that. You should have a choice. You should have a right to ask questions. Kyrie Irving, Bradley Bill, Andrew Wiggins, and Jonathan Isaac have been have been getting lynched on Twitter and other um sites, and it's downright unfair. They should not be getting treated the way they shouldn't be getting treated like shit like shit because they want to ask questions and they're being smart. I'm I'm sick of this. We are living in a time where our voices are being destroyed and, and put down, even on YouTube. They don't even push your videos. They only push videos of those who are a part of the agenda. And we've been seeing this for years. Guys like Ticket had to open up his own platform on other um, places like Patreon and other sites. And shout out to that brother for... Because they don't want him to get his truth out. They don't want him to tell the truth. Carcino for life for years, they've been destroying him, trying to destroy him. And guess what? He's still here. And we ride with our boy. We're going to ride with him, Ticket, Self Talk, Kwame Brown, Bus Life, everybody, Seattle Seahawks, Jose, Rodriguez, C Pen for the win. You know. Um, who did it this time? Scrub Zero. You know, we all riding. Strictly, shout out to him. Even though them sorry ass taters lost. Oh, don't worry. I'm, oh, I got the video coming soon. <laughs> I told you that if you guys lose, I said, dog, you guys are going to lose to a team like Kentucky or somebody. Y'all do this every year. But I'm off track. But in my opinion, this is how I feel. I feel that in sports, they're trying to see. Now, the NBA is saying, well, you don't have to be vaccinated. They're just being soft on it. But they want you to be vaccinated. They want to force it on you. But they see the backlash they're getting from it. So let me know in the comment section, man, what y'all feel about this. Do you all um, agree with Ted Cruz for supporting the players? Or do you feel the players are whining too much and just need to get the shot? Thank you for listening. Like, comment, subscribe, share this. Hit the notification bell to select all to receive upcoming notifications. And if you love what you hear, you can donate to the page by cash apping me at the word welcome. The number two and an HDII TV. Thank you all for listening and thank you all for your support. We are out. Deezy.